I would also like to see more young people getting involved in producing new events and projects. I think there's nothing better than working in the arts. We need people to set up record companies. We need mail order. We need people to promote gigs. We need people to take a few chances. We all love to perform. There's nothing better. But actually, we really need people to sell the, the records, promote them, and put on the gigs. It's the best thing. You can't beat it, actually. So there's, there's so much experience out there that would be really up for helping you. So please, have a think about it. Get involved. <laughs> This year, the awards held a special dinner on the Friday night to honour our new Hall of Famers. So tonight, we have a second chance to celebrate their contribution to our music as we take a brief look at some wonderful Scots music careers. He had a lot of courage, a lot of confidence in what he was doing. And um, the first time I saw him performing at one of his gigs, you know, it was just wee Martin on his own with all these instruments and I just remember thinking what a lot of courage to, to, to do that all by yourself, you know, with, with this huge audience and um, I think that was one of the things that defined Martin was his, his ambition to, and his vision to, 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 to create the music that he wanted to create. He had such a respect for the music and the tradition that people just loved what he did. The Hall of Famers 2012, they're all represented here tonight themselves or their friends and family. Would you all please stand so we can say thank you once again. Ladies and gentlemen, our Hall of Fame inductees for 2012. <laughs> Magadi de Tafelum. Moran Tang Guiv Ulegicharshin.